As you can, if you watch at the moment, our chest is rising and falling. So she's actually simulation, simulating breathing. Um, but obviously the main thing of pregnancy is the birth. So what we've got here is a very pregnant tummy. And, and inside there, um, which you can peel back the stomach, I shall peel that back for you. Oh, Craigie. What you've got, that's actually, that's what they call an automated delivery module. Um, and in there, there is a, a model of a baby. So what you can do is simulate the birth of a baby and you can have that as quick or as slow or as complicated as you want. So the baby's in there um, and the stomach goes over the top and what happens is in the stomach around about these areas there are some speakers as well so trainees could listen to the stomach and hopefully the idea would be to hear maybe his baby heartbeat or anything like that. So once that you've done that you have that all set up Whoever's running the simulation can then set the, the, the mannequin can be moved to, to represent all the different positions that a pregnant man might want to be in. The legs are, are all movable. So you can put them, we're going to get a delivery bed hopefully, and we can put the, the lady's legs in stirrups. And sorry about this, but there's a baby in there ready to give birth. And with this monitor here, with the simulation running with a bit of luck, the baby will start to be delivered. So the baby's head is just starting to be delivered now. And at that point, that's where I don't know where to go. <laughs> no so problem. I, I can do that bit. But what happens is that the baby will, as you can see on the little diagram there, this is the baby being delivered by the machine. So in the, in, the, in the abdomen, there's a bellows. So the compressed air is pushing the bellows out and pushing the baby out at the same time. And all of this stuff is to allow whoever's running the simulation to have whatever sort of scenario they want. So you can alter blood pressure, heart rate, um, how fast they're breathing. Um, as you've already seen, um, I shall demonstrate again, you can have some sounds. Or you can have uh, some different sounds like that one. We'll just keep that decent. <laughs> That's pretty incredible. <laughs> what we've got is on here as well. You can have heart sounds. So the heart of the mum. You can simulate the different different heartbeats. You can give her different sounds in her chest. So if she had a, a, a problem with her breathing. You've got um, different things with the fetal heart, so you can have, if you want the fetal heart, the, the baby's heart. So if you want to change that, make it go up, make it go down, so fe fetal distress. And what else you can do, you can also show if the lady was having a seizure, for whatever reason, during childbirth or before childbirth. And then you just switch it off again once. Right. So what, you would let it fit, and you've got places where you can simulate giving drugs. So you would give the, the patient the drugs, and then with a build up they would work and the seizures would stop like that there you go seizures have stopped brilliant